In our election watch, Colorado's primary one week from today. And while we're primarily a mail in ballot state, there will be some changes for folks who need or want to vote in person. New size Allison Zimmerman watching out for us tonight with a breakdown of what we need to know. June 30th is Colorado's primary, and you may be thinking, didn't we already do this? Well, kind of. Back in March, the state held its presidential primary on Super Tuesday. And now it's time to select candidates for Congress, state legislature, and other races like district attorney. So here's what you need to know. Election officials sent out ballots June 8th. If you're an unaffiliated voter, you'll have two ballots, unless you already told your county clerk which ballot you wanted. But you can only pick one party's ballot to vote on. If you fill out both, your vote will not count. And you'll need to sign the envelope before turning it in. It's now too late to mail your ballot back. The deadline was June 22nd, but you can still turn it in by dropping it in one of these drop boxes by 7 p.m. on June 30th. If you do want to vote in person, it's going to look a little different because of COVID-19. Election workers will be in mass. Voting equipment will have to be cleaned after each use. You'll also need to practice social distancing if you go. This primary, similar to the presidential one, is also open to 17-year-olds. If you're 17 and you'll be 18 by the November election, you can vote in this primary. Always watching out for you, Southern Colorado, Allison Zimmerman, News 5.